on Capitol. She was born to lead. He was born to conquer. But together, their passion would set the world on fire. We were meant to be. I knew that the moment I rode over that hill and saw you. Capital. She was born to lead. He was born to conquer. But together, their passion would set the world on fire. We were meant to be. I knew that the moment I rode over that hill and saw you standing by my tent. Prince Ali, Sloan Denny. right. You are the most beautiful woman in the world. Mmm. Oh, what is that? It's called uni. You like it? It is delicious. So you approve of my surprise? Ali, I love your surprise. And you're not still angry with me for not telling you where we were going to go? Oh, was I angry? What are you thinking about? I was just thinking about surprises. I was thinking about the first day out on the desert when I was waiting for you. I wasn't sure when you were going to come or if you were going to come. You knew I would. No, I didn't. But I think the suspense was part of the pleasure. Well, I'm glad you feel that way. I'd hate to be accused of being arrogant and overbearing again. Now, did I say that? Those exact words. You know something. You are breaking your promise. What promise? Not to bring up our fight. What fight? Uh, <gasps> Ollie, why did you decide to bring me here? I tried to imagine the farthest place from both our worlds. And you thought of Japan. I... I love it. You know, I do feel very, very far away from Washington right now. You do? Mm -hmm. How about you? Oh, I feel very far from there. Does it worry you, Arlie, to be so far away from your country right now? It's in safe hands. Jeffrey? Jeffrey. He's a wonderful man. Father, friend, brother. Mm -hmm. All those things that I've accomplished, I don't think I would have been able to do them without him. Very glad you have someone like him that you can trust. I trust him with my life, and I owe him a lot. Without Jeffrey, I wouldn't be here with you right now. Sloane, I meant what I said earlier about balancing the public man with the private one. For all those years, all I thought about was Barack and my people's fight for freedom. And then you came into my life. And you made me realize there was something else I care about. Something I couldn't let go of. Does it make you uncomfortable? No. For the last year, the only thing that I've really cared about is my work and my career. And then you walked into my life, and I realized that there is something else that I could care about very much. I feel like I am floating on a cloud. Ali, everything here is so peaceful, simplistic. Simplicity is an art form in Japan. I wish life were this simple. Well, it can be. Do you really believe that? I believe it can be a lot less complicated than what we make it. been here before? No. <clears throat> I've always wanted to. 
My father used to come to Japan. And to him, it was very different from Barack. And at the same time, very similar. How is it similar to Barack? Well, in the sense of tradition, sense of beauty and ritual in everyday life. He's a very simple man, and yet very strong. He was a good man. I wish I could have met him. You know, my father speaks so highly of him. He was a wonderful father. Good leader. You must miss him very much. I do. It's a terrible thing to lose someone before you realize how much you need them. That is an experience I hope never to repeat. This has been such a wonderful evening. You know, I hate to think about leaving here. Then don't. Of course, if you want to go back to Washington, that can be arranged. And if I don't want to go back to Washington? Stay here. Sometimes, even in the best of families, no one hears the cry for help. If you care about life, you can't afford to miss Silence of the Heart. Tonight at 9, 8, 7.